It's a place of magic, of love and the holiday spirit. And for kids battling serious illnesses, it's a day to escape their troubles. This is Operation North Pole, a fantasy trip for kids and their families. If you don't believe, you will believe that they. Okay. Anthony and Rena Servan will never forget their experience, a special memory now, after losing their five-year-old son, Lucas, affectionately known as Bear, to cancer. We've made lifelong friends out of perfect strangers because of this event alone. After a breakfast, the families head out on a decorated metro train starting in Crystal Lake. At every stop, first responders and community members cheer them on. Once in displays, a police and fire escort leads the group of up to 75 families to the Transform Stevens Convention Center in Rosemont. And it's all volunteer work. Nobody gets a collection paycheck. It's just incredible what they do. Inside, the 28,000 square foot ballroom becomes a winter wonderland, welcoming the families to explore candy stands, games, performers, and more. Operation North Pole absolutely gave us a, a whole day of joy that we didn't have to think about it. We didn't think about cancer that day. I know for a fact we didn't. We didn't worry about the hospital. We didn't worry about anything. All we focused on was watching the kids have an amazing time, enjoy themselves. It's going to be our Lego tree. The Cervone family now volunteers for Operation North Pole, putting up two trees to honor Lucas. Another tradition, they play Secret Santa to another child by fulfilling their Christmas wish list. It's just something that I, I think we can never forget that we were there that day. I'm glad we got to enjoy it. And the Lucas got to see that because he, I don't know, his eyes were so big. After you've seen it once and after you've lived it once, You'd, you'd be crazy not to be able to go back and help them. There's so many things that you can do for Operation North Pole to help them and help families like ours. I mean, it just make you feel better. I know it will. Mm. That's a great story. Mm -hmm. There are still tickets available to this weekend's high tea with Mrs. Claus to help raise funds for this year's event on December 15th. For more information, head to Operation North Pole's website. And Megan, we, we've talked about this before and my how important those events are for families mm -hmm. who have yeah. children who are sick and, and just that routine of being in the hospital and getting out is mm -hmm. it's so important to them. And to be with other kids who are struggling with something yeah. too, then they, they can parents. really forget about it. Yeah, yeah. beautiful yeah. that they yeah. give them back like that. Yeah, it is.